Welcome to Morning Act for South Africa. I'm Professor Ntembu. Today's topic is advanced HIV. Now, everyone who has HIV or everyone with HIV needs to take HIV treatment called antiretroviral therapy at or ARVs. My name is Andy Lemotoli. Advanced HIV means you have or could get certain illnesses that happen when someone's CD4 cell count is low. All children under 5 have advanced HIV diseases. CD4 cells are infection fighting white blood cells. The fewer CD4 cells you have, the more you are at risk of illness. In South Africa, Almost a third of people living with HIV start treatment with a low CD4 count. Um, everyone diagnosed with HIV or re-entering care should get a CD4 test. Now, advanced HIV disease is a CD4 count below 200 cells for adults, adolescents, and children over 5. All, tri- all children under 5 have advanced HIV disease. The risk of death is higher with the low CD4 count, especially that is below 100 cells. A CD4 count below 50 cells is severely advanced disease. A seriously ill adult or adolescent might have a shortness of breath, rapid heartbeat, unable to walk without help, high temperature. A seriously ill child might have sleepiness, unconsciousness, convulsions, meaning violent, irregular movement, unable to drink or breastfeed, repeat vomiting or high temperature. The best way to prevent advanced HIV disease is to start at when your CD4 count is high. Everyone should start at when they are diagnosed whatever their CD4 count is. For more information about HIV treatment and CD4, see our booklet starting at. Starting at rather week gives you the best chance of getting better and avoiding illness, even with a very low CD4 count. People with advanced HIV disease need a special package of care, including counseling, art, and medicines to prevent or treat other infections. And they need information so that they are comfortable with their decision to start at. TB, a bacterial infection, is the leading cause of illnesses and death. Among people with HIV, especially people with advanced HIV diseases, those who are not yet taking ART, symptoms are including coughing, fever, night sweat, weight loss. People diagnosed with TB should start TB treatment before starting ART or restarting ART. People diagnosed with TP should start TP treatment before starting or re-entering ART. So for more information about TP, see our booklet called ART and TP. Now everyone starting ART will be screened for TP. This might be adults, adolescents, and children who do not have TP. These people should be offered TP preventative therapy. All people with TP symptoms should get a sputum test called EXPECT, MTP, or what you call RIF. Adults, adolescents, and children who are very ill or have a CD4 count below 100 cells should get a urine, a urine test called tp LEM. People with advanced HIV disease often have severe bacterial infection in the bloodstream, nose, mouth, throat, voice box, windpipe, or lungs, the brain and spinal cord or stomach intestine. Contramoxazole protects against some but not all people with HIV in places where SPI or malaria are common should get lifelong contramoxazole, whatever the city for count. This one is available for people who react to contramoxazole. Cytokokal meningitis is a serious fungal infection of the brain and spinal cord. Symptoms are as follows, headache, fever, nausea, vomiting, light sensitivity, confusion, behavioral change. Adult adolescents with CD4 count under 200 cells per cubic millimeter 
should have a crack test and a lumbar punch if necessary. If positive, depending on how bad the disease, fluconazole alone or combination of other medicines, empathoresin B and ultrasound C will be needed for treatment. PCP is a fungal infection, is a leading cause of illness, death among adult, adolescents and children with advanced HIV diseases. Symptoms are cough, chest pain, fever, tiredness. It can be prevented and treated with contramapsosome. Toxoplasmosis, a common infection caused by a parasite, can make people very ill if their CD4 count is under 200 cells. Symptoms may be similar to those of TP, cryptococcal meningitis, or pneumocystis, or they might have headache, confusion, seizure, blurry vision, and poor coordination. Cryptomaxazole can be used to prevent it and for treatment, as well as other options. People with a CD4 cell below 50 are at risk of CMV retinitis, which is cytomegalovirus retinitis, that is an eye infection. Symptoms are blood vision, blind spots, peripheral vision loss, floaters, small white specks, and light flashes. Untreated, CMV retinitis causes blindness, and antiretroviral therapy can prevent CMV retinitis. It can be treated with medicine that is taken orally or injected into the eye. Getting tested for HIV, starting at and taking it every day, can prevent HIV from weakening the immune system. For people with advanced HIV, taking art can help the immune system to recover and other medicines can protect you from the opportunistic infections. For more information about treatment, we have a free app um, that is called Modern Art for South Africa. You can find it on Google Play Store. We are also available on YouTube. We are also available on Facebook, Modern Art for South Africa, and on Instagram. Don't forget to like on that button below, and please press the bell, the bell icon so that you can be notified whenever we upload new videos. Thank you.